Welcome viewers, former President Donald Trump was once criticized for having uncharacteristically low energy all through his 2024 presidential announcement, and one reporter posted on Twitter that some of his supporters tried to depart earlier than he completed speaking. But before we proceed if you are new to my channel please kindly take a moment of your precious time to hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell for latest updates from us. On Tuesday night, Trump spent about an hour speaking in front of a crowd of supporters at Mar-a-Lago to announce his 2024 presidential campaign. He spent tons of the speech repeating the equal traces from his rallies chiding President Joe Biden's approach, championing his very own financial record, and calling for balloting reform. Olivia Rubin, reporter with ABC News, posted a video on Twitter of the crowd at Mar-a-Lago. She commented that a crowd formed through the exit of the ballroom and humans had been attempting to go away earlier than Trump completed his speech. She introduced that security might not let them. John Carl, ABC News chief Washington correspondent, additionally stated that he noticed human beings attempting to go early and that they had been now not allowed to go away the hall. He speculated that it may have been due to the fact there had been worries that if a few human beings left, the corridor would begin to empty out. Brennan Murphy, producer at The Recount, commented that it was once the most bored Trump crowd he has ever seen. Others, inclusive of Meghan McCain, additionally criticized Trump for the boring speech. Kumar Rao, a lecturer at Columbia University Law School, puzzled if Trump was once ill or just weathered now. However, Michael Bender, reporter for The New York Times, had a one-of-a-kind take on the audience's response to Trump's announcement. He posted on Twitter that Trump had his crowd's interest for the entirety of the 63-minute speech. He cited in his tweet that there have been some murmurs of facet conversations taking location in the again of the room, however stated standard most human beings had been cheering and chanting, Trump has given that stated that he feels compelled to run due to the fact of the nation of the U.S. and that the solely aspect that would maintain him from jogging would be if his fitness did not permit it. Unlike in 2020, when many rallied in the back of Trump for his re-election campaign, his most up-to-date bid for the Oval Office has been met with blended reactions. Republicans advised Trump to now not pursue the nomination, or at the very least extend the announcement till after the Georgia runoff, out of fears it ought to negatively have an effect on Herschel Walker's Senate bid. During Trump's speech, various networks reduce returned and forth between his remarks and their personal commentary. Fox News's Laura Ingraham stated when they reduce a way that they'd return to the speech when there was once something newsworthy. Others, however, have wholly embraced Trump's bid for office. Georgia Representative Marjorie Taylor Greene recommended Trump in advance of his announcement, and Florida Representative Matt Goetz prompted Trump to announce his candidacy earlier. What is your honest view and opinion about this video? Please kindly drop your comments below and thanks for watching.